today we visit Catalina Airport, also known as the Airport in the Sky. My first time actually visiting this airport was with my instructor Justin. I had an amazing landing for my first time, well, actually for any time. Unfortunately, this was not one of those landings. I came in very high, very fast. As you see there, I kind of ballooned a little. Either way, it's better than being low and slow because anybody who's researched come into this airport know that because it's on a mesa, you have to worry about any downdrafts on the approach end. So part of the reason why I'm very conservative about how I do this approach is because I'm a little afraid of those downdrafts. So I always come in a little high. The problem was I just came in too fast. One of the scariest optical illusions for people who have not been at this airport is that it kind of levels off at the top. You actually come in on an incline and then it levels off, but the incline portion makes it look like the level off is the end of the runway, which is not. You still got a couple of hundred feet left. So no worries. Take your time. You'll be fine. As I said, the first time I landed at Catalina was with my CFI at the time and friend now, Justin. I will never forget this. We parked, we got out, we ran to tower. We got a receipt because he's an Aero Club member, meaning he can land there as many times as he wants. We ran down to the restaurant, we picked up a cookie. And we ran back to the plane, did all our pre-flight, went to the run-up area. And as I was doing the run-up, I just looked to my right and he is in heaven eating his peanut butter cookie. Now the only reason we were rushing is because Justin was a stickler for being late for his students. He hated it. But yeah, so that is the memory I have of Catalina. So every time I go, I always think about that peanut butter cookie. A quick note about Catalina's operation hours. They're very strict about only coming in during operating hours currently 8 to 5 p.m. And after you park, the first thing you definitely need to do is go to tower to check in. You do not want to end up on their whiteboard list. checklist time if you liked our video please give it a like if you don't want to miss our next video please subscribe and if you have any questions about catalina the peanut butter cookie or anything else please leave us a comment checklist complete now go ahead and start planning your flight to catalina and i do mean plan as there is a lot to consider when coming to this airport but i promise you it is totally worth it